iPad Lover showcases the powerful, creative, and entrepreneurial capabilities of the iPad and its apps. Hey everyone, Robert here, and I wanted to show you how to merge uh, GarageBand effects onto a single track. Now, I'm going to go ahead and open up a song that I made for this tutorial called Dancing Creatures. So I'm going to pop that open and get rid of the whole airplay warning which isn't relevant. Now as you can see I've got three tracks here along with an FX track. Um, just a basic uh, drums, keys, and bass track. Now I'm going to go ahead and we're going to pop off the effects and let you listen to a little bit and hear out sounds. Okay, so you get the idea. Now we're gonna add the FX on here and let you hear what it sounds like with the FX. Now, as all of you know in working with GarageBand and you have the effects going, the effects usually go over the entire track. So if you have um, 15 tracks of instruments and you add an FX layer, it's going to affect the entire song as so. Okay, so you get the idea. So what I want to do is I want to get it off of the entire song and I want to basically put it onto the bass line. So what you want to do is you want to tap on the bass line and you can get the merge option up. So we're going to go ahead and tap on merge and the bass line is selected by default but what we're going to do is we're going to select the effects track and we're going to tap on the upper right hand corner merge and there we have a new track so the once that was baseline is now set up as the merge line and we can in essence get rid of the effects track now I'm gonna go ahead and rename this track because this is my baseline um, we're gonna go ahead and get rid of the audio recorder and we're gonna go ahead and rename it and X that out and call it bass Okay, and done. So let's take a listen as to how it sounds. Okay. So you can hear that the bass line has the effects only. If we go ahead and mute that out and just listen to the drums and the keyboards, the effects that were once there are no longer there. Okay, so it's, it's no longer there. The effects are only on the bass line. Let's go ahead and take a listen. Okay. So we've got that there. Now the nice thing about this is that I can add another effects layer if I choose to and add it to the bass line or add it to any of the other instruments. Now I'm going to go ahead and do another one and let's go ahead and add another effects layer. And what I want to do is I want to go ahead and change up the keyboards. So what you can do to get a better idea of how you want things to sound is that you can mute all of your other tracks and just work with the keyboard line or whatever instrument that you got going on. Okay, so let's go ahead and play around with effects. And for the sake of tutorial, it's not going to be great, but I just want to show you what's going on. 
Okay, so that works enough for me. Let's go ahead and rewind and let's go ahead and unmute this so we can hear what it's going to sound like with the keyboards. Okay, so if we were to keep the effects as they were, the effects would be completely over the entire track. But what we're going to do is we're going to do the exact same thing that we did before and we're going to go ahead and tap on the keyboard and we're going to merge the keyboard with the effects and merge. And then we're going to go ahead and select that and call it our keys just to keep everything nice and organized. And then once we're done, you can go ahead and delete the effects track. And there you have the effects added to two of them. Now I'm going to leave the drums alone because I think you're getting the idea. But the cool thing about this is you can tap on my songs and you can see that Dancing Creatures has copies made of it. So that if you ever wanted to go back to your original one, you can go back and work with each change that has been made. So I thought that this would help those who wanted to add effects to individual tracks and you can add even more effects to the track that you have already done. So I hope that this helps and happy garage banding. Later Gators. Thanks for stopping by. Please show your support for this channel by visiting our Patreon page.